Today we'll be going over the installation and removal of your harmonic damper on your engine. The first step would be to check the harmonic damper for any burrs or nicks on the outside of the hub and the inside of the hub. The next step would be to check the crankshaft snout to ensure that there is also no burrs, scoring, or marks that would interfere with the proper press fit of the damper to the crankshaft snout. The next step would be using the included high pressure lube that's with your damper, or you can also use anti-seize. Liberally apply the high pressure lube to the inside diameter of the, for the damper, as well as the outside of the crankshaft snout. This lube will aid you in properly installing and removing the damper in the future. Next, you will take your harmonic damper and place it on the end of the crankshaft snout, starting the damper over the end until it no longer presses forward. Then you will take your harmonic damper install tool. This particular damper tool is one that we sell at Innovators West with an LS specific adapter stud for this LS engine. You will then thread the installer tool into the end of the crankshaft. Once threads are bottomed out in the crankshaft, you'll then take the nut and thread it forward until it contacts the face of the damper. Once the installer tool touches the face of the damper, you'll then grab your wrenches. One wrench goes on the end of the tool and holds the install stud steady. The larger wrench goes on the hex of the install tool and you will then turn it drawing the damper onto the crankshaft snout. You continue to install the damper until it bottoms out against the lower crankshaft gear. You will feel it have a sudden stop, at which time it will be solidly against the gear and ready then to install your crankshaft bolt. You can now remove the installer tool. Once the damper is fully installed, you're ready now to install your crank bolt and washer and torque to the spec provided in the instructions. The Innovators West machined washers have a raised step. This raised step is designed to go underneath the head of the bolt. You will then take your crank bolt and washer, threading it into the crankshaft, and preparing to torque it to spec. With your crank bolt fully engaged by hand, you can then Grab your torque wrench, set the reading on the torque wrench, the spec provided in your install instructions, and with one smooth pull, pull the crank bolt fully tight until your torque wrench clicks. We will now show the proper way to remove your harmonic damper from your engine. Your first step will be to use a large breaker bar to loosen the crankshaft bolt. Once loose, you can then use your hands to fully remove the bolt from the engine. Once the bolt is fully loosened, it can be removed from the damper with the crankshaft washer. The harmonic damper has six countersunk bolts that hold the aluminum body to the steel hub at the back of the damper. Using an Allen wrench, we will then remove three of those six bolts. Once you've removed the three hub bolts, you will then be able to grab your removal and install tool and install it into the face of the damper using the supplied bolts with the kit. You'll then thread into those existing holes where we just removed the cap screws. Using your wrench, you will then tighten the bolts into the hub making sure that they thread all the way through the hub and protrude out the back. This is important to allow proper engagement for the puller bolts all the way into the steel hub at the back of the damper. Once the damper bolts are threaded in, you can now turn your damper installer tool until it becomes tight. At this time, you will grab your wrenches and be able to start the removal process. Towards the end of the removal, you will notice that the damper will get very loose and it will start to turn freely. At this point, you can then grab the damper, wiggle it, and it will then pull all the way off into your hands. Please be careful not to drop the damper. If you have any questions about the install or removal of a damper, please feel free to contact us at any time. <music>